Hello, hello, my friends. Today, the question is, what is an intelligent way to eat out while keeping in line with your health and fitness goals while staying and enjoying your overall dining out experience with friends or at a social gathering event? Golden tip number one is to simply check out the restaurant menu before you go. Bad decisions can always be made when those hunger pains strike you and you smell the sweet aroma in the air and it's time for you to make your order and you feel the pressure when the host is standing right there in front of you telling you to make your order. Don't give the host that power. Golden tip number two is to eat in before you eat out. This might feel a tad counterproductive, but by having a slight feel of having a protein snack before arriving at the restaurant, you will be able to suppress the hungry base decision making entirely. Don't go for anything too large or simply too much. Simply a smoothie will do the trick. Go to tip number three, quickly review how the meal is cooked. The way the meal is cooked generally tells you a lot about the nutritional value itself. Golden rule number four, ditch the soda. Eating your calories is one thing, but drinking them is borderline unnecessary. After all, when compared to you eating real food, golden tip number five is to treat yourself to the starter option. The starter option by ordering something with some light soup or salad will prevent you from overeating. Golden tip number six is avoid the bread. Simply, just as simple as that. Golden tip number seven, request a healthy swap. Many meals often come with accompanied with french fries, potato chips, or white bread. Golden tip number eight is coffee over dessert. As appealing as it is, desserts are bulked up with butter, sugar, and cream. If this video was helpful and you would like help with getting a custom meal plan to help you stick to your goals so you can achieve your fitness goals long term, fill out my personal training application below and you can also go and fill out the application in the description.